Why I feel like I ain't seen y'all in a minute? I don't know. But I miss y'all, though. So I said, you know what? I'm going to bring them on my day. Come spend the day with me. No, we ain't shopping. I'm on a shopping break. I've been busy laying at the father's feet and working on my brand. And working on my brand is what we doing today. Come on. Let's go. Welcome to my office. See, I'm one of those people that love to start something and then jump to the next thing before I finish it. And the Holy Spirit has been doing an amazing job at keeping me on track. Like today, I just wanted to go lay down and take a nap. I got up in the midnight hour. I was up super early, like 4, 3, 30, 4 o'clock in the morning, sitting with the Father. So I want to lay down, child. But the Holy Spirit like, uh -uh, get to them shorts. So I'm going to get to them shorts. Okay, so I have, um, I got red shorts to him and blue shorts to him. Today, we're going to do the blue. We got about one, two, three, four pair to him. Let's do it. See how I just tried to take that shortcut? Holy Spirit said, uh-uh, do the red ones too. So you know what I'm doing. The red ones too. One down, nine more to go. These took me about 40 minutes to an hour. Mm. All right, that's 10 pair of shorts. Now I have to do some um, heat pressing over here on my old Cadillac of a heat press machine. That thing be trying to throw my arm out of socket, child. But I'm gonna go ahead and get on on it. It still gets the job done. Hallelujah. Okay, so as I was working, I was experiencing some warfare, some mental warfare. That's where the battle is. I was really agitated. <laughs> and I was trying not to get to the point of anger. So I had a moment with the father. It was so beautiful. I love him so much. He calmed me right on down. And it was just, it's my heart right there. That's my heart right there, babe. But I heard, um, I just heard come and read with me. So the father wants me to come and spend some time with him. But this, what I do um, building my brand is actually spending time with the father as well. I just want you to know that because some people think that um, being saved and walking holy means that your life is now going to be boring. This is a thing. Yeah, you didn't know that. It's a thing. Yeah, people think that this is boring. People think that God, the creator of heaven and earth, the creator of the universe is boring. <laughs> they lost. But anyways, um, so this is spending time with him as well. Um, my brand is to uplift the kingdom of God. This is my ministry. Um, God gifted is an, uh, my homage to Holy Spirit and, his, and the gifts that he gives us spiritually. The spiritual gifts and the talents that he gives us and, um, and helps us to steward and nourish and grow. That's what this brand is all about. Um, uplifting the kingdom of God, glorifying the king of heaven and earth, the king of all kings, glorifying big God over here is what we're doing. So this is spending time with him as well. Spending time with the father is not boring. It's not listening to choirs all the time and just reading your Bible all the time. No, what it is, is on your day-to-day -day basis, it's, this is a lifestyle day to day everything that you're doing you're you're allowing him to go before you you're asking him to go before you and keeping him on your mind throughout the day so of course i'm keeping jesus on my mind while i'm working on god gifted so um let's see what word he has for us before i go open your bible okay so what i was experiencing was persecution from the enemy and his minions um so the word that the father gave me was perfect for this moment that I was experiencing, of course, duh. And um, I want to share with you guys. So for anybody that's feeling persecuted, just first of all, know that we wrestle not against flesh and blood. Meditate on this. Meditate on John 15, 18 through 25. And always remember that 
the persecution is against the spirit that works within you and not against you personally. We have to learn how to not take things personally as believers in Christ. We have to just, we, we literally have to have tough skin. And the way that we get that is through the strength of Jesus, which is why, you know, I, I, I stopped, I prayed, I paused, I break because um, the enemy really tries to wear me down. I actually just got off a fast as well. So um, it's just some it's some warfare still still lingering. But we warriors here. This is what we do. This ain't for the weak. It's not for the faint. We're not going to be weak. We put on our armor of God and we keep it stepping. So at the end of the day, that was my work day. <laughs> uh, I started today at, at like 1130 and it's about 540. Somebody go eat my nachos and then take my walk. I did my nails. I, did, I had a good day. It was a very productive day. And um, I love y'all so much. Jesus love y'all. Remember that. Stay focused. Stay motivated. Stay prayed up. Most of all. Most importantly. And I'll see y'all again in a minute. I don't think I'm going to leave y'all for that long again. I felt like I was gone for a little minute. Y'all miss me? Nah. It's all good because I still miss y'all. You see what I'm saying? As a soldier in the army for the Lord, you can't let nothing like that bother you. I still miss you. You don't love me. I still love you. Amen. Smell you later.